Hello friends, welcome back to the YouTube channel. This is Rahul and today we are going to perform the next exercise for curve parametric sketch tutorials. Okay, so we have this sketch drawing for the, the drawing purpose and uh, we'll draw this on curve by using curve parametric software. Okay, so just uh, take the screenshot of this drawing. Okay, uh, it will be helpful for drawing on this curve parametric. Those who have the Creo Parametric software, please open your Creo Parametric software and take the new file. Click on the file, take the new file. Keep part as a type and solid uh, in subtype as a solid. And uh, here you can put your file name over here and tick this tick mark. Click on OK. Now system is generating the interface for me and simultaneously we have to select the unit of working like. Uh, millimeter part hardness the parts i am going to create in millimeters that's why i have selected that one and those who have uh, those who are new on this channel kindly subscribe the channel because the design skill video of our crew parametric and all different softwares 3d softwares are available on my youtube channel uh, okay so first of all just read the drawing because before drawing any drawing we have to read all the parameter all the dimension what the input drawing is given so that you can get that drawing okay so uh, and uh, one request is there uh, those who don't have the Creo parametric software please go to the channel the video is available for how to download Creo parametric software and how you can install on your pc in free okay so in this drawing uh, if you observe first of all this center line is here one circle second circle this diameter is 54 diameter here this is 94 diameter here six circles are here of diameter 12 by pcd 74 diameter okay and next uh, if fillet is here radius of radius 10 36 diameter distance between this is here next uh, for this portion these two circles are here of diameter this outer circle radius 23 and for this radius 12 inner circle okay and the angle for this two circle from in this quadrant is 30 degree from this axis and for this same is there so first of all what i will do that uh, i will draw this center line okay i will start the drawing uh, from here yeah this from here i will start okay go to your curve parametric click on the front plane click on the sketch then click on the sketch view now here center line command is here take the center line draw the vertical center line next draw this horizontal center line yeah next what i will do i will draw first of all this circle 54 diameter is here okay take the circle command draw the circle move away press middle mouse button double click on this and put 54 here next click on this zoom or ref, uh, refit command yeah next i will uh, draw this uh, outer circle how diameter is this this is the 94 diameter for outer circle take the circle command like this move away and 94 diameter next uh, two circle i have drawn now i will draw this uh, pcd by using construction line because this is imaginary line okay for drawing these uh, six uh, dia six small circles first of all i will okay but uh, these circles or uh, these six circles uh, will draw only in pattern command okay and the sketch uh, in sketch creo no pattern command is there we have to draw this rather uh, in the extrude by using extrude command in parts okay so oh, how to do that i will explain later first of all i will move uh, to next part like uh, i will draw first of all 36 distance here are the two lines this first line and second line by distance 36 and the circle diameter is given 12 radius okay and distance angle is th 30 okay 
we can draw this line for 30 but one thing is that yeah what is the opposite of this okay because if we i draw this line with 30 degree but we require one point point this point so what is the, this is the this is given pcd circle and here, here it is given radius 100 okay so by using these two parameter this radius 100 and 30 degree line i will get this point the center of the circle okay so first of all what i will do is i will draw this 30 degree line and this radius 100 circle uh, circular pcd p circle now circular diameter go to the sketch and yeah take the click on construction mode then take this line command this is the first point so little bit zoom out draw at any dimension move away press middle mouse button angle is created over here this is the angle 34 i will make 30 degree next i have drawn this uh, i have required to draw this also but i will uh, instead of drawing line in this quadrant i will mirror this portion okay so i will directly radius 100 this circle imaginary circle so keep a construction mode on take the circle command draw from by taking the center draw any circle and actually it got skipped take again circle this has a center and yeah press escape button like this double click on this make now this is the radius okay so i will make to 100 like this now i have i have got this point so that i can i will able to draw this circle at this point intersection point by taking this intersection point okay this is now still we are in the construction mode so i dotted circle is uh, creating just click on the construction mode now this is activated and take again circle command by taking the center draw the circle of which the uh, 12 radius okay 12 radius and his diameter is generated so 12 radius means 24 diameter double click on this put 24 here like this next select this circle and click on this mirror command click on this axis the circle is mirror over here okay now in the circle i have drawn this portion for drawing this portion okay now what required next uh, I required okay okay just join just required to join this both the circle this shape will get okay so for that I will take uh, R command and in arc center and ends okay take the center this will be the start point this will be the end point move away press middle mouse button okay just zoom this just con for confirming actual exactly join or not yeah it's joined for confirming whether it's exactly joined or not i will show you how to check then take the second um, again arc center and ends take this point and uh, this point okay okay okay, okay. just press the escape take again this arc this will be the first point and this will be the okay 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 i selected wrong in wrong way actually i use that command wrong way again take this rar command this we this is the center and this will be the end point this will be the first and this will be the second yeah take the trim command trim this portion trim this portion trim this portion and this portion move away and press middle mouse button yeah it's a close structure now okay now uh, what i will do the next i had drawn this middle uh, this uh, middle portion now outer portion is pending how much 23 ds okay 23 means uh, 45 yeah 45 diameter <coughs> no 
not 20 uh, actually yeah yeah 23 uh, radius is given here for this so if you take the circle command and yeah this is the circle center draw the circle like this yeah now diameter by uh, by default here 65 is there and make it 46 mm okay yeah for this radius diameter will be 56 yeah for this also click on the circle click on this mirror command click click this axis okay now next what i will do is that i will take this center and ends this is the center and th these are the ends okay take again this arc this has a center this has a yeah like this take the trim command now trim this unwanted portions okay in this uh, which this will be the unwanted portion yeah is it put the drawing no this will not be the press control set yeah take the trim command this will be the unwanted portion okay right now in this this will be the unwanted portion trim this this trim trim yeah trim this portion also this portion this portion also and this portion also and this portion okay now this portion is completely drawn okay this portion is completed now what what is the uh, pending this 36 for the 36 i will draw i think i will draw this first line second line then i can put the fillet value take by using fillet command for this and for this also now for this fillet command fillet value is not given here i think okay here radius 10 is given and this fillet is not given here okay so i uh, will take any value so first of all just uh, take this uh, yeah take this line which line this line chain command and i will draw uh, first of all okay i will draw any image in line for this from here to here okay now dimensions are created what will be what should be the dimension here yeah from this to this this di uh, total dimension is 36 okay so just divide this 36 diameter by 2 okay what will be this 18 millimeter here distance will be this set 18 and this set 18 okay now make this the dimension distance 18 mm like this and next click on this line and mirror this line instead of mirroring uh, just press the escape i will take this fillet command circular fillet and select this portion i will try for fillet and select this yeah here fillet is created of 6.7 radius move away <coughs> move away and press middle mouse button adjust the dimension like this yeah and how it was how much it was yeah radius 10 okay double click on this make this 10 radius like this and for this take this fillet command select this and this line yeah like this okay mm, by default by default this line is got cut but in the drawing it exists here but by default system has generated system modified that line actually so for that it's okay i will draw again it later okay now i got this uh, this much portion now this is extra portion which to be i got this extra portion because here red dot is highlighting so take this trim command trim this much portion yeah move away press middle mouse button and 
first of all press the control key and select this line this line and this curve option ok and then click on mirror select this middle axis same position is drawn here but what the difference is here actually this is this is not connected actually it's ok I will take this R command center and ends for this this is the center again draw this point like this this will be the first point and this will be the second point ok yeah like this yeah now what I will do go to the sketch yeah this portion is in this ok now exactly portion is drawn what I required as I required now what the things are pending to draw yeah only these circles are pending right now ok yeah like this click on the sketch view ok click on ok click on this refit yeah then click on institute we'll try for h2 whether system is uh, if system is generated this h2 perfectly so this sketch will be the perfect if the sketch is not closed then it will not create any h2 portion like this what is asking select a plane or paint surface as a sketching plane if i select this plane okay yeah mean the sketch is still not close perfectly that's why this extrude is not created ok click on ok yeah like this session is incomplete click on yes close this command and go to the sketch edit click on the sketch view ok so in this lots of portion is not closed properly uh, like uh, I will just show you here this point is open here ok Yeah, here you can see this is not close egg perfectly take this trim command zoom this much portion and I will try to trim this portion ok if I trim this portion yeah now this is the perfect yeah move away this red dot I removed here this red dot is again showing here what the matter is there yeah this is also not joined perfectly ok zoom this portion ok so this is the matter this is not perfectly joined for perfectly joined what I will do again I will I will try one other thing click on this line delete this line now take this arc and again center and ends ok this select this point is the center and I will draw ok exactly from here and for this end yeah right now it will it will be move away and press middle nose button yeah this end is completely closed board for but for this end still problem is creating but it's okay we'll solve the problem yeah yeah this is getting connected i think over here we'll see inside is there I am just finding where it is get intersected still this line is not intersected anyway I will try to trim any portion and let we will see if I trim this portion the whole circle is getting trimmed ok press the control Z again press ctrl z now again take this arc center and end points click on this center and right now here actually it's showing completely tangent like this but it's not getting exactly connected if i select this this is correct connecting exactly for this
yeah okay this is not getting connected exactly because this reason the circle radius required to increase i think okay little bit because still this is not getting connected if i draw perfectly so what i will do is that yeah i click here right now move away and i will change the dimension of this circle okay like i will select this point press control z zoom this much portion yeah at this point is not getting connected connected exactly i will increase the diameter of this take this trim command trim this circular portion press control z not this much this circular portion trim this circular portion yeah like this and now take the trim command yeah trim this much portion also yeah then next what i will do take the circle command how much diameter of for this outer circle is given here for outer yeah this 23 ds yeah 46 take the center i will draw circle which will be exactly tangent to this line okay yeah like this and move away press middle mouse button take the trim command trim this portion yeah right now it's exactly get connected yeah at this portion move away and press middle mouse button then we'll get exactly connected or not I'm still showing here red dot why it red dot is showing here just see this line by zooming if i try to trim this line yeah this single line which is getting trimmed nothing is trim zoom this line again zoom out then move away and no, not move away yeah this line is getting trim okay press control z now get take the trim command try to trim this line yeah trim this portion this portion and this portion move away press middle mouse button yeah right now it is getting perfectly uh, connected no red poor red dots are showing here okay i got succeeded right now and this problem comes most of times and we never understand uh, it, it's not getting extruded this sketch is this sketch is not getting properly closed so how to solve the problem but in my video i will try to convey all the things okay now here this red dot is here and here is also showing open connection not closed properly yeah if you zoom this okay so it's required to close or resolve so i will resolve like uh, which method first of all i like to see which line is going outside okay for this line okay this is going here take this uh, yeah click on this zoom again this yeah right now here take the trim command in hand and then yeah the outer portion is open in uh, for this and for this line first of all just see okay this line is outside and for this 
this also you just take this trim command try to trim this portion if i trim this which portion is trimmed okay 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 now it's will it will be getting clear move away press middle mouse button it's perfectly get connected and red marks is, is red mark is removed now for do same process for this also zoom this portion yeah it's actually not not even connected okay okay so for that what i will do again zoom this you can see this circular portion is outside and this circular portion here this is this side and this is this side so for getting connected either i require to shift this to this side or this circle to this side okay so i will yeah for this circle i will try to increase or connect yeah i will connect by zoom also just zoom this and take the line command this will be the yeah first point and this will be the second point i will take somewhere here like this still it not it's still it's not connected okay so now what i will do i will try one or another command select this much portion this portion means this line and this curve this both the curve select by pressing control here one close command is here i will try using this and i will zoom no still it's not get connected it's okay one last option is i have and that will i trim which okay this portion and this this circle actually and i will try to redraw this circle take this circle i will directly cross this circle okay yeah move away press middle mouse button take this trim command and trim this much portion now right now trim this this portion this portion and for this this portion and this portion now it will be completely close move away press middle mouse button yeah you can see now only two red dots are highlighting means this is not completely getting connected to the line in completed sketch okay now this high this is now highlighting by pink color means completely close volume structure is here now for doing this so just zoom this portion i have to trim i just just zoom this which portion is outside okay this portion is inside and this line is coming from this side okay this is getting crossed from this to this so this is the extra line take this trim command and okay okay zoom out now i will again zoom for trimming this line here is the actually end yeah here this is the end of line yeah this line i have to trim take the trim command yeah, it's getting completely trim i think okay press the control set press middle mouse button yeah by the way now it's getting cleared okay now for this just zoom this portion for red dot and which portion this portion is outside so take the trim command and try to trim rear not this portion press control z just outer portion i have to trim zoom out right now move away by default i trim this much portion and so press control z again just have a look on the drawing yeah it's required this portion is required just need to close the draw drawing zoom again this for red dot now take the trim command and try to select this line only yeah like this zoom out and observe the drawing okay move away press middle mouse button this circle is also getting trimmed okay i will close 
the circle by arc and which center and end center and this is start point this will be the end point move away press middle mouse button now this red dot also i removed and made a completely closed structure now this portion is pending go to the arc center and ends take this, this as a center this as a first point and this tangent point for this yeah this will be the end point move away press middle mouse button now completely closed structure is here no red dots are available okay click on okay yeah right now click on extrude yeah why it is not getting selected now the completely closed loop structure is there okay but yeah click on okay yeah this section is still showing incomplete click on yes click the close go to the sketch edit this yeah so for creating a true some modification in drawing required to change actually this was the drawing only for practice purpose ok if you wanted to make the extrude perfectly so some setting is required like just take the trim command and required to trim this portion this portion and this portion this portion because for extrude required a sketch which will be the completely single volumetric close structure move away press middle mouse button right now yeah it's look like completely close volumetric structure if i click on ok and click on the extrude yeah right now here extrude is created ok so definitely we will get idea so what's the importance of that red dot in grow parametric what it's indicating it's indicating the not not close structure ok just click on this green tick mark, the green tick mark. yeah your sketch is ready like this okay so thank you very much friend for watching this video kindly subscribe the channel please hit the bell icon and definitely uh, i am doing so much hard work for uh, for you for, for providing conveying all the contents all the comments of parametry so this uh, hard work will be paid off so just require a subscriber please subscribe share it your friends and thank you very much.